You need to change this one super quick setting to reduce input latency in all games and also boost FPS in most of those games. It will work for all Nvidia, AMD and Intel GPUs, helping you reduce input delay, achieve more FPS and fix any micro stutters that you might be facing. So let's dive into it. The setting is very simple and easy to implement with proven results that show how much of a difference it can make on the input latency within most of the games. However, the FPS increase does depend on your system, so keep your expectations according to that for FPS boost. The setting we are covering today is the message signal interrupts or more commonly known as the MSI mode. But before applying anything, why do we need to turn on the MSI mode in the first place? MSI mode improves how your GPU communicates with the rest of your system, especially your CPU, which helps a ton in various tasks to be performed efficiently. Rather than having those tasks be queried first by the CPU, the GPU does this heavy lifting for you, which allows the system to perform the upcoming tasks far more efficiently. So go down into the description of this video and download the MSI Utility V3 from my website. Once you have it downloaded, go ahead and open it up and extract it using 7-zip, FinRAR or really whatever you want. Once it has been extracted, simply right click on it and run it as administrator. If you don't run it as an admin, it won't work properly and will show an error message. Now inside of here, you will find a list of bunch of devices but the only one that you are concerned with is your graphics card. For me, it's my NVIDIA GeForce GTX 750 Ti on this machine and if I look under the MSI column, you can see that the box is unchecked for my GPU. Now basically by checking this box, we are allowing a GPU to use more than 4 IRQs whenever needed. Simply go ahead and check the MSI box alongside your GPU and under the interrupt priority I know that a lot of people set it to high but through my testing as well as others that I have seen, setting it to undefined works the best. Because if you set it to high then the games that mostly use CPU will have a lot of stutters. Because your GPU IRQs are getting the priority, therefore setting it to undefined works the best for any game that you might play. Once you have followed these steps simply go ahead and click on apply and close out of the tool. Then go ahead and restart start your PC but after restarting before going into the game once again right click on it run it as administrator and just make sure that the MSI box is checked and the interrupt priority is set to undefined. The reason for this is because sometimes when you restart it, the system may reset it so that is the reason we want to make sure that everything is applied properly. Now some people also use MSI mode utility for the network adopters to get a better connection speed which is really a minor improvement however it is still worth it if your network adopter does support MSI mode under the supported modes. So if you want to set your network adopter to that as well, simply go ahead and do so. But now that you are done here, go ahead and check out this video if you want to optimize your gaming experience to the next level.